we on. Shalom, shalom. First of all, we want to start off by giving all praise to and honor and glory to Yahweh. Yahweh, 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 Double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. We do well and peace and salutations to our icons across the four corners. And it, um, truth, pu pushing this truth and risking their lives to do so. I'm your brother, Kari Young. This is brother, Bacar. Yeah, we just come out here to uh, reach our people, you know what I'm saying? First and foremost, we get into the house of Israel. If your uh, lineage go back to I Isaac, Abraham, or Jacob, you know what I'm saying? You are the true Israelites, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, we going by the uh, prophecies of, the, of these scriptures, man. We ain't coming to you all of our vain opinions, you know? We just coming to uh, warn our people of what's coming to pass, you know what I'm saying? Death um, and destruction to America. You know what I'm saying? And we only speaking to our Israelites, first and foremost, the men. No, first and foremost, the elect and the men of, and the, um, men of Israel. You know? Uh, uh, right. Oh, and just to correct you, the order is Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Come on, come on, come on. Slack it, slack it. All right. This uh, this Isaiah, chapter 1, verse 2. Hear, O heavens, and give ear, O earth. For the Lord has spoken. I have nourished and brought up children, and they have rebelled against me. Okay, see, the Lord done brought up um, us from the land of Egypt out of that um, bondage and that captivity that we was in, you know what I'm saying? And the Lord, as he says in the scriptures, he got a controversy with the house of um, Israel. You know what I'm saying? He, he nourished and brought us up. When you go into that word nourished, you know, so y'all had I should have had that word nourished. I don't know already. Uh, got that word nourished? I could look it up real quick. Come on, get that word nourished. Uh, yeah, because um, the house of Israel, we are the um, the chosen people of the Lord, that God. You know what I'm saying? That's our power. You know, as it um, tells you in Matthew, the uh, fifth chapter, that we ye are the salt of the earth. And, and um, that's why the Lord is angry with us, because we lost our Savior. You know what I'm uh, it's a Google definition of the word nourish. It say to pro. It say provide with food or other substances necessarily for growth, health, and good condition. Kind the Lord, the Lord um, brought us up out of that slavery, brought us through Egypt. You know what I'm saying? Show, um, put them, um, put them eleven, no, no, put, seven, seven. put them seven plagues on uh, on them um, Egyptians. You know what I'm saying? Brought us out of that hard bondage. And he nourished us, you know what I'm saying, fed us in the um, wilderness, took us through the wilderness for 40 years, you know what I'm saying, and brought us to another land, man, brought us out of that captivity. Uh, and they say, and brought up children, and they have rebelled against me. Yeah, kind of. So, at the end, so the children, us, you know what I'm saying, Israelites, we rebel against the Lord, you know what I'm saying, on our power. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh son. Um. Uh, Right, and two thirds, they still rebuilding. They still re, um, re, rebuilding on Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, man. You know, cause we all heard no telling these people that they Israelites telling them to come back to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, what, which is who you people ignorantly call God and um Jesus Christ. But what they do, they walk past, they laugh, they talk shit. You know, cause in the future we talk about in the last days. There shall be many scoffers walking out their own lust, man. You know, and that's what our people are doing, man. And our people is you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native and Indian descent. Y'all making the real child tribes of Israel according to the Bible, man. You no, know? but y'all rebellious, y'all rebelling against the most high. Y'all want to stay in the hood be niggas. Y'all wanna eat pork, shrimp, crab, and lobster. You know? Hey, y'all y'all wanna um y'all wanna have sex with another man's wife. You know, hey, um, hey, but the Lord nourished y'all up. He brought y'all up. He gave y'all your own man, your own woman, your own kids. You know, God. hey, hey y'all health care, say, um, good health conditions. You know, hey, but he took that away from y'all, man, because y'all don't want to follow him, and y'all still don't want to follow him. God, I gotta, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, um, this one I'm gonna get in Deuteronomy. Um, this is 28 and 1. And it shall come to pass if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice thy to the voice the like, unto the voice of the Lord thy God to observe and to do all his commandments what I have commanded thee to this day, 
that the Lord thy God will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. So yeah, uh, that's all we had to do was um was listen to the to the to our power, you know what I'm saying? Listen to the voice of the Lord thy God and follow them um, statutes and commandments, and we had blessings coming for us, huh? We was gonna we was gonna be above all these nations, but the Lord sat us down, man, sat us right down on our ass, man, and put us into this low state, man. Put the woman above us, put the heathen above us, man. Ma making us work hard, put us in that slavery. And he scattered us amongst all the nations, man. And uh and, 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 and um took away our heritage, um, so to speak. You know what I'm saying? Wish the heathen um did that, but you know what I'm saying? That was just part of the curses though. All we had to do was hearken unto the Lord thy power. So that's why the Lord said he nourished us, brought us up, gave us all these blessings. He he gave us these blessings, but if but since we didn't listen to him, he took them away and gave us the curses. So all right, Kyle. Can, can, can you go to the 15 first? Just Kyle. for edification? Yeah, Kyle. This is Deuteronomy 28 and 15. But it shall come to pass if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God to observe and to do all his commandments and his statutes which I have commanded thee this day, that all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. Ah, right, man. And that's what happened. We, we all feel as a nation, man. You know, um, can, can you get um, 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 Isaiah 39? But yeah, we all feel as a nation, man. But you niggas, y'all don't want to get right, man. You know, and that's what that's why the Lord is about to send judgment upon you niggas, man. You know? Hey, he, he about to use he about to use his blessing, which is Esau, the so-called white man, according to the Bible, you know, to um mess you niggas up, man. Because y'all ain't trying to get right. You know, hey, and, and these these curses is upon us, man. That's why that's why people have sex with your wives. Your wives. You know, that, that that's why you broke. You know, that's why you live with, with roaches and, and rats and shit, man. You know, hey, that, that that's why. You, you don't got nothing. That's why um our people, you know, look 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 um look look bad looking and stuff, man. You know that's why you bitches bald head, man. Uh, that's you why know? that's why we um that's why we we getting fed this poison. That's why uh, we getting these chemtrails in the air, man. That's why uh, we catching these diseases from these wicked ass scandalous ass bitches, man. Right, man. Cause y'all don't want to come back to your house by her show. Your house shine, man. You know, the, the true God, you know, hey, the, the, the only God out there, man, you know, um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to finish this up real quick. This is um, Isaiah chapter 1, verse 3. The ox know of his owner and the ass his master's crib, but Israel doeth not know, my people doeth not consider. Right, man, hey, look, the, the two dumbest animals, they, they know they master cribs. But um, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native and Indian descent, you know, y'all don't know y'all creator, man. You know, y'all y'all worship Jehovah, you know, or Jesus Christ, or Allah, or Buddha, you know. But y'all don't y'all don't worship Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, man. You know, and y'all y'all don't consider, man. And God, that's even it's a definition to that word consider. It say to discern, understand. To observe or give heed to to um, distinguish um, is it, sight understanding to be to be to be intelligent. You know. God, first thing, first thing, uh, uh, niggas happen to see is when they see us up here with these with our garments on and our beards out. You know what I'm saying? Looking looking rugged. You know what I'm saying? Preaching this um, word of the Lord, they also automatically say "Assalamu alaikum." You know, they they automatically think we uh uh what is them uh, Muslims or whatever. Tom. They don't even consider that we preaching the um the gospel of the Lord, man. They don't right. even consider that, man. Because Muslims don't read out the Bible. Man. You know, hey, two niggas did that shit earlier. They dumbasses, man. Yeah, come on. Past laughing, saying that, that shit, and man. that goes in observing. That goes in. You ain't even observing, man. Walk past and look and observe before you speak, man. Ah, right. Hey, the, the, the scriptures say, um, keep thy foot right. when it comes into the house of the Lord, man. Ah, right. Be ready, be more ready to hear than to give sacrifice to fools. Uh, no, because um, they, they consider that that they don't do evil, man. You know, they, they, they thought they ain't nothing wrong doing that shit, man. You know?
know, but they they they, they just offended the Lord, man. You know, sure. hey, and now they just got marked for destruction, man. You know? Um, I'm, I'm I just preach it real quick. This Hosea 4 and 6. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, because thou hast rejected knowledge. I will also reject thee, that thou shalt be no priest to me, seeing that seeing thou hast forgotten the Lord thy God, I will forget thy children. Right, man. Hey look, you 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 niggas is um spiritually the destroyed, man. You know, and y'all about to be physically destroyed in a minute, you know? Cause y'all hey, but y'all y'all destroyed because y'all got this knowledge, man, you know? Hey, this is the true wisdom right here, man. You know, this is what you should be seeking. Nothing else, man. You know, hey, but and it's it's y'all rejecting this, man. Y'all y'all ain't just reject this in this life. Y'all rejected this in your shot time, in Moses time. You know, y'all been doing this for thousands and thousands of years, man. You know, and that's why two thirds of, of two thirds of the nation of Israel gonna die, man. You know, and and it said that thou shall be no priest to me, right? Y'all got no priest, man. You know, y'all deserve no priest, man. You know, and you know, cause, hey, cause y'all y'all don't even y'all not even um um attempting to get right, man. You know, and it said y'all forgot the law. You know, hey, the Lord gonna forget your children, man. Yeah. You know, hey, and that's why niggas get their head blown off, man. They get their head blown off nowadays, man. Cause it, it, on a deeper note. Y'all or your children, man, in, in the reincarnation, man. You know, hey, they they, they told um, Pilate, let his blood be on us and our children, you know? And that's why y'all about to die in two-thirds, I mean, in um, Jacob's trouble, you know? This is Isaiah 30 and 9. That this is a rebellious people, lying children, Time, right, children. of rebellious people, lying children, like I said in um, Isaiah chapter one, y'all rebel against the Most High, man. You know, y'all y'all are um, a rebellious people, man. Y'all are um, lying children, man. You know, and y'all lying because y'all not um, preaching the word of Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai, man. Y'all not learning this, man. Y'all believe that bullshit. Y'all been um, taught by y'all grandma and y'all mom, man. You know? Yeah. Keep going. <laughs> Children that will not hear the law of the Lord. Right. Y'all don't hear the law of the Lord, man. You know? Hey, the, 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 that's the Shema prayer. Shema, Yasharala, Yahweh, Allah, Yahweh, Yahweh, Akkad. You know? Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Hear, O Israel. The Lord, our our God, is one Lord, man. You know, y'all not hearing, though, man. Y'all not listening, man. Y'all rebellion against it, man. This is the law of the Lord, man. Hey, salvation is right here, right here. Hey, the, the, the secret house, the, 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 the secret place of the Most High is right here in front of everybody, man. You know, and I'm only talking to you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native and Indian descent, because you so-called white people, and you fucking Arabs, the rest of you heathens, y'all, this ain't for y'all, man. Y'all going into slavery, man. You know? This is only for the children of Israel, according to the Bible, man. You know? Put it out. Yeah, America is getting destroyed, man. America is about to get destroyed in the near future, man. And there's nothing you can do about it, man. And if you're an Israelite, you need to come back to the Most High, man. Yeah, this is Proverbs 28 and 9. This is Proverbs 28 and 9. He that turned up away his ear from hearing the law, even his prayers shall be an abomination. Right, it say, he that turned up, he that turned up away his ear from hearing the law, even his prayers shall be an abomination. No, if you ain't hearing the law, if you ain't seeking the law, if you ain't seeking Yahweh Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, you know, hey, your ass is down, man. The scripture, the scripture say, um, the, 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 um, the last, the last, um, chapter in Mark, and it's like verse 15, I think. But, um, I got something real quick. 
Uh, I feel the spirit rolling though. Alright, this oh This um Salakia, bear with me. This is Second Corinthians, Salakia. This is Second Chronicles, chapter fifteen, verse thirteen. It say that whatsoever would so like you, that who so I'm, I'm gonna bring it back. This second, this second Chronicles chapter fifteen, verse thirteen. That whosoever will not seek the Lord God of Israel should be put to death. Right. So if you ain't seeking this, you are gonna be put to death. It say, whether small or great, whether man or woman. Right. So if you ain't seeking Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, you. It's you and your family shall die, man. You know, you, you you will be put to death, man. You know, I'm gonna stop the camera.